Hello, Rick Malava here. My nickname in the simple Yamaya forums is CTB Ram. And a little while back, one of the users, Subsurf, was asking how you can achieve a linear fall off in Maya. Uh, what he wants to do is he's got this cylinder and he wants to uh, bring this half of the upper face or upper cap of the cylinder up at a specific angle, but he doesn't want to rotate it. He wants to bring it up to the angle, but he wants to keep the vertices in line, and that's called a linear fall off. Now, uh, there were s several good suggestions. Uh, Dave Rave suggested you could use the cut faces tool. Um, I suggested you could either just uh, create an edge, uh, a, a curve, a straight curve, or something with an angle from a side view, and just eyeball it, or you could also use a, uh, a Boolean tool. And then uh, one of the users, Primate, actually suggested something I wouldn't have thought of using a nonlinear flare. And uh, today I was doing some modeling, or the other day I was doing some modeling in Maya, and uh, I realized that I had come up with a way to do this a long time ago and it just didn't dawn on me when I read the thread. Uh, I kind of have a love-hate thing going on with Maya right now. I've had an issue with uh, my uh, system stopping refreshing uh, at random times and so it's kind of put me off modeling with Maya for a while and I totally forgot about this technique. Uh, but what you can do is uh, use a deformer just like uh, primate use but instead of the flare where you've got to do some extra little steps you can do this very quickly with the lattice deformer so if i was to come in here in a uh, similar example to what uh, the original user was asking for and select just the vertices on the face that i want to rotate and then i come down here and i create a lattice deformer i can come over here now and just pick these vertices and pull them up and from a side view here you can see that that is a linear fall off, giving you the angle you want. And the reason I remembered this is I was modeling something uh, to help somebody out, uh, modeling up a shape for them, and this is a, a portion of a of a deck of a spaceship, and it's got this uh, this area here that angles down. And uh, once again, if I was to take it and just use uh, use a uh, Ro a rotate, you can see from a side view here, if I go into wireframe and I rotate this down, you see the the vertices are not in line with one another. Um, now what you can do instead of that is if I come up here go back into solid shaded mode and I grab these faces. This is another thing, uh, another tip here. A lot of people don't know about some of the selection tools in Maya. If I hold the control key and the right mouse button, this marking menu comes up and I can s change that face selection into a vertices selection. So now I've got the vertices which is required by the create deformer tool. Come down here and create a lattice and just like I did in the other example, grab these verts here and just simply pull them down and that creates a linear fall off with that ramp sort of running down here. This would be like a scoop or something. Uh, and then you can come in here and get rid of that face and you know now you got sort of a scoop going into the side of something. So there you go. There's another method for uh, doing a linear fall off using the, uh, the lattice deformer. I hope this helps you out and uh, good luck with your modeling.